Well, I guess I sort of owe a sort of apology to the people in British Columbia when I said you're the province of BC is Canada's biggest dumpster fire. I should have expressed that differently. I suppose I should have said perhaps having gone downhill further and faster than anywhere else. Southern Ontario is the armpit of Canada, and I've always said that. I lived in British Columbia from I was 17 years of age. I left home with a knapsack full of socks and underwear and 400 bucks and stayed floating around British Columbia for 17 years. Beautiful place, but it's a mess now. And that's really what I meant. And when I say our Southern Ontario is the armpit of Canada, I've, I've always said that, despite being born and raised here and having returned here for <laughs> longer than I care to mention now. But that's what I meant. I didn't mean any offense to the province as such, but truly it is a mess. And I needn't talk about the points that, I, that I'm talking about. I mean, but if, if Ontario beats you in anything, it's we're the auto theft capital of the world, not just the country. But uh, I do think that the NDP is a threat there. And in the comments, you'd said the Sunshine Coast, the lawns are a sea of orange. When my mother used to come out and visit me in BC in the early 80s, I had to take her to the Sunshine Coast and the Bouchard Gardens every time. Bouchard Gardens is down on the island by Victoria. You know that in British Columbia, but anyways, the rest of the world might not. My mom was a big Bruno Gerussi fan. Uh, what was the show? Oh, what was the show? Huh, I'm drawing a blank. Relic's boat was still down on the wharf by Molly's Reach there, and Mum thought that was a giggle. We climbed down onto the little vessel that was still floating there at the time. What was that show? Oh, I'm drawing a blank. Anyways, I know the election's close. That sea of orange in the Sunshine Coast, I wonder... And I'm being semi-facetious. You should take a bus tour, perhaps. Load up all those people and take them on a tour of the Lower Mainland. Maybe they need a reality check. Nice drive down, uh, oh, in East Van Hastings Street. Maybe, they, maybe they're a bit insulated and isolated up there on the Sunshine Coast. I haven't been there in years. So, I'm assuming it's still a quiet little kind of remote location removed from perhaps some of the ugly reality but I am being somewhat facetious with the bus tour trip maybe some pamphlets stuffed in the mailboxes anonymously at night give them some graphs and charts on finances and the statistics on the dumpster fire issues in British Columbia anyways just a rambly sort of video I certainly meant no um offense to a province that uh, I may end up back in yet. I always loved British Columbia. Uh, remember Bill Vanderzam? Faye Lee Young in a paper bag with $20,000 cash in it? <laughs> oh, well. Kitsilano in the 70s and 80s. What a place, eh? Cheap. Oh, hey, Wreck Beach, Spanish Banks. Oh, I could go on and on. Yeah, I'd uh, I'd like to be C C B C C British Columbia turn itself around if there's one province I would like to see turn around. All the best to you.